November 9th, 2010. Uh, this is today's climate update report, kinda. I'm gonna go off track a little bit. I'm gonna start today at uh, spaceweather.com where they are contradicting themselves. Um, they're saying um, forecasters estimate a 20% chance of an X-class flare from sunspot 1121 during the next 24 hours. At the top of the page in the Daily Sun, you know, at the circle, and it shows you the sunspots. Now, down below on the NOAA forecast, uh, they are calling for a 50% chance of a Class M flare or a 5% chance of a Class X flare. Now, if you go to SolarSoft uh, latest events, and that's the website I showed with the question about the solar activity you can scroll down and definitely see uh, something major going on with 1121 looks like uh, we're in the middle of or just getting done with a major CME and uh, the charts are going crazy but I showed you that before they've continued since I posted the last video now on to uh, more local and uh, important things Indonesia Mount Dempo volcano activity intensifies, say officials, according to Scott.net. Um, they are also reporting um, troubling global volcanic activity on the rise. Uh, and I'm going to read a little bit of that. The news is all about Tuesday's US, U.S. elections, but some of us are concerned about the news on Monday regarding the possible eruption of Grimsvatan volcano in Iceland. Um, never heard of it? You will. Uh, Grimsvatan, I, I know I'm saying that wrong, uh, is the most active volcano in Iceland. Uh, one, The one that made uh, a lot of news earlier in tw 2010 was uh, the one nobody can pronounce, Ejigivol. While uh, relatively small, generated such a huge closet cloud of ash that disrupted air travel across western and northern Europe for six days in April. We all remember that right before the big oil spill. Uh, here's why volcano watchers around the world are on high alert. This past week in Indianola, or in Indonesia, <laughs> after a tsunami killed several hundred people, sadly, um, Mount Maripai rumbled to life, forcing thousands to flee back to evacuation centers as 38 lava avalanches occurred uh, proclastic flows down the south and western slopes running towards seven kilometers. Uh, they incinerated everything in their path. In August, a volcano in Sumatra erupted for the first time in 400 years. Uh, I reported on that. There is a ring of fire that stretches approximately 25,000 miles in a horseshoe from eastern Asia to western shores of North and South America. It has 452 volcanoes, of which 75 are the world's most active or dormant. So 75% of the world's volcanoes on the ring of fire is a very active area. Uh, they're also reporting a massive winter storm to hit Ireland um, today. Uh, this report was out on Sunday, so that was yesterday. Um, today or tomorrow for sure. And uh, if we go to the RSOE, a volcanic eruption has occurred at the mountainous Makon district in Kowande, local governments of uh, Benue State. This is in Africa. With one person feared dead while properties worth millions of Naria have been destroyed, residents of the affected community have deserted their homes in search of safer place. Sources of potable water have been polluted by the heavy magma emitted from the eruption. Uh, Vanguard gathered from eyewitnesses that there were heavy vibrations around the mountains at the border with uh, Cameroon Republic, followed by eruptions at, at six points on the mountainous terrain. Six points. The vibration spewed magma which covered streams and had dug wells and the entire community leaving the people without potable water. At the moment there is panic amongst the people who are said to be cut off completely from the rest of the world as a result of the occurrences and dangerous and damages to roads and bridges which was occasioned by the heavy vibration. Uh, and they also go on to say the volcano is unknown. 
the report is very troublesome if this is true because the report said followed by the eruptions at six points on the mountainous terrain we need more information etc crater width eruption points coordinates so please tell you that this report used with in, with incredulity so they're not really sure what's going on over in Africa uh, just that uh, they had a major volcanic eruption in six places in the mountain and that's in Nigeria. And again, uh, RSO is, RSOE is still reporting the volcanoes in Iceland and uh, two different volcanoes in um, Indonesia. One in the Sunder Strait and one in central Java. And of course we already know all about those things. Uh, China is reporting a cold wave. And I got landslide in Peru. And of course that nuclear incident in New York. Um, and again, there's reports of extreme weather in Canada. I was watching earlier today, they had reports in uh, Asia uh, as far as floodings and that kind of thing. But uh, the volcanoes are definitely ramping up and uh, we definitely need to be aware. And as far as the sun goes, um, we're getting contradicting reports. And again, like I said, uh, if you go to the SolarSoft latest events website, I will post the link below. Uh, you can definitely see from the graphs that there's something major taking place right now um, with the sun and 1121. So um, stay tuned and enjoy what you can. Thanks.